Hey guys, it's Premier 91, and I'm talking about Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Now, those of you who've been keeping up with the news know that the PS4 is getting a timed exclusive mode, which is Spec Ops Survival Mode. And if you guys recall, from Modern Warfare 3 and even Ghost, the survival mode was a lot of fun. It was greatness. Like, they would so send, like, helicopters and men, and you'd get all these, like, perks, and you'd be able to summon your own helicopters, I believe, and stuff like that. So, it is kind of sad that it's going to be a PS4 exclusive for a year. Yeah, that's a long amount of time to have an exclusive mode. I mean, can you imagine buying the game for Xbox or PC even, and just having to wait a whole year to play that mode that if it's anything like it used to be is really, really fun? Even the narrative director said that like the console exclusivity for the Spec Ops Survival Mode is above all our pay grades, basically. I'm just paraphrasing. And it is true. It's not the devs' fault. They don't make this decision. Activision makes this decision, and Sony makes this decision, basically. Sony basically pays Activision a certain amount of money, I'm pretty sure, so that they can have timed exclusive deals. Now, remember, Microsoft had this back on the Xbox 360, but it was only a month. They used to get the DLC a month before PS3 users. So, to make it a year, that's a big jump. I wonder how much more money Sony is paying Activision. But... And it does suck, because I really like this mode, and I don't own a PS4, so I'm probably going to have to wait a year myself if I get the game. But timed exclusivity as a whole, that is a business decision. you got to understand these are businesses, and Sony especially. Remember, they have the majority when it comes to amount of systems sold, so they have the ability to kind of push people to getting PS4. Not literally, but when you see all your friends playing a game, and you really want to play with them, and especially in survival mode, you want to play with your friends. You don't want randoms as much with survival mode. And especially since Call of Duty Modern Warfare seemingly is going to be cross-play, Sony can't just push you going, hey, you wanna play with your friends, you gotta buy our system, because this is cross-play now. So if Xbox One or PC users wanna play with PS4 users, I'm assuming they just can because it's gonna be cross-play most likely. So Sony seemingly is doing this to kind of push people, hey, let's buy PS4, it makes sense. They're like, we want people to buy PS4, so let's include this mode as a timed exclusive for a whole year. That, and it may work, unfortunately. It may push some people to buy PS4 so they can play survival mode with their friends. It may do that. I'm not saying it will, but it may. And it may be a pretty good business tactic, but let's face it, it's anti-consumer, and it kind of sucks that they're doing this where you're getting timed exclusive modes for certain consoles. I'm not downing Sony or Activision or them as a whole because I know this is a business move and it may work and maybe it turn out to be a pretty good business move, but it kind of does suck that it's anti-consumer. But what do you guys think about this? Are you guys kind of mad that there's going to be Spec Ops survival mode exclusive to the PS4 for a whole year? Or do you guys just not care that much? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching, like, and subscribe. May God bless you all.